What's good, YouTube? This is your boy Mario RPG. I hope you're having an amazing morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. And today we're back with more Jujutsu Kaisen. And today we are reacting to episode 34, Pandemonium. It's a good word. And that's a uh, good title for an episode. That gets me hyped for this episode. Before we get into the reaction, be sure to like and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Definitely check out the Patreon, patreon.com forward slash Mario RPG. If you want the merch, Link is in the description. Um, I'm I'm cozy mode right now. You know you're cozy when I'm not gonna lie. It's freezing in England, um, and yeah, so I'm just chilling. Um, anyway, cozy mode. We're gonna react to some anime. I think I'm gonna make this a double episode. I think I've got enough time, so we're gonna do just that. Let's react to episode 34 of Jujutsu Kaisen: Pandemonium. Here we go. Nanda. Oh, the new world, okay. What the hell? すごいな。初めてだよ、こんなの。むさ苦しい上眺めもあれ。こちらとしてはもう少し眺めていたいが。そうだね。何かあってもいやだし。平門。こう。Yeah, but you you're holding. I mean, it doesn't matter. Okay, so it's cool that you can only use it once, but you used it well. Let's be honest. You got you got a good Pokemon there. You got Charizard. Now you got Mewtwo. Nanio I was wrong. Well, you never know. Sakteki <laughs> Motorbike? How was that sound? いつ、に、二人かな。いたどりくん。こいつらと君がさっき戦った呪霊どっちが強い？多分さっきのバッタより強い。呪詛師は無視して先に進もう。まずは五条くんの安否確認だ。ダメだ。もう渋谷の状況
そうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだそうだ工場封印を術師戦隊に伝達工場奪還をこちらの共通目的に据えろおところで君の交差はまだ凍結されていないね<笑>工場サドルが消えれば技術界も人間社会もひっくり返るねえねえ僕は好きな方見つけじゃあねえさまみんなサイムメイメイだね気に動いていいよ合わせるから全員起きたねさて今後のどうしたなんてやつIt's got a very unique OST. I don't, I don't talk about the music much because it's、uh, nothing jumps out crazily. But it's a unique OST. I like that I've done that. ああ。ガイズをされ、建物内に待機していた人間が今になって品質使用を吸い始めたか。だから我々も待機をやめ突入。仕方のないことですが、対応が後手に回りすぎです。私は帳を下ろしている敵を二人は片っ端から一般人を
もし封印が本当なら終わりですこの国の人間すべてダイアンいやーバレたねこっちの状況術師が総力上げてここに来るよ私はここに残るけどみんなはどうする俺は弟の仇イタドリユージと釘崎ノバルを殺すその後交戦に保管されている他の弟たちを回収する釘崎とやらは知らんがイタドリはダメだつくなにする関係ないえジョーゴ落ち着いてうんやっぱ俺もイタドリ殺したいかなマヒト何よ五条悟るの実物を見た感じさ五条を封印した今術師と呪霊はイーブンスクナが復活すれば超優勢ほぼ勝ちってことでしょまあそうだねじゃあさ今の戦力でも勝つ時は勝つってことじゃんイタドリ殺しちゃおう It's so well done how like creepy cheery they are Does that make sense? It's like so go away, let's kill them all. Do you know what I mean? It's really well done between uh, Mojito and uh, uh, Ghetto. It's like delu the, delu the evil delusion is insane. Like, they're nuts. They really are. And it's been so well portrayed. They're, they're psychos, man. <laughs> スクナなんていなくたって俺たちなら勝てるさ。スクナは味方ではない。復活したことでわしらが大リスクの方が大きいかもしれない。だがスクナが復活すれば確実に呪いの時代が来る。わしらは今の人間どもとは違うのだ。
そういう連中がみんな困ったさんになってしまい最悪消されるそしてその2パワーバランスの崩壊五条悟がいるからという理由でおとなしくしていた呪詛師呪霊たちが一斉に動き出す負けたらどうなる少なくとも日本では人間の時代が終わるかもしれないですね<笑>分かってんじゃねえか May want the age of the curse. Curses. Nanami san ga modoru mai ni tobari o bukkoas. Dojo satoru o taskeru do. Oh, that's a good image. I love, I love images like that. That's a good image. <laughs> what the hell is this thing? It keeps being near. It keeps being with Ghetto. Hmm. I don't remember that grey haired girl who was with this guy. I will be honest. The one I called Kill You a Sister. I'm really, really looking forward to seeing what Hey Archie can do and uh, Spiky Head Bro with Panda. Damn, that was a good episode, man. This, this, these past two episodes have been really good. MVPs are hard on, man, because Itadori was really good in this one. Um, but I think I'm going to give it to Ghetto. I nearly gave it to Mojito. But just, it really should be both of them. Just the maniacal, like just like happy go lucky crazy vibe they give is just so well done one by the animation and how they look and two their relationship and then three the voice acting the voice actors just nail it like you can't especially mojito he's just got a perfect voice actor like the child like psychotic teen do you know what i mean voice um, his voice actor reminds me, it, his voice actor is like the perfect voice actor. It's almost like uh, the guy of Chainsaw Man. Is it Denji or Genji? Um, that kind of like that, that kind of voice actor, like. You know what I mean? Just you, could, you couldn't see any other voice actor be that good. I also really, really like Gojo, man. Is his name Gojo? Jogo. Jogo. The uh, one eyed guy. It's really cool having him with those because he's like the typical villain. And then he, even he's, you can kind of tell, is weirded out by uh, Mojito and Geta. Do you know what I mean? So it's really cool having him in that group. And yeah, man, we're just going to get straight into the next episode because this is just really, really good. Episode 35. Science. Science. ともしねま、まあまあの威力だなマジかこいつ打撃だけなら七海さんとタメ張るんじゃねえかわあそうかだからこそその理屈なら帳の元はかなり目立つところにあるんじゃないですかより見つかるリスクを抱えてさらに強
地上四十一階からの落下だぞ。もちろん、金木爺。まったく。若者は年寄りをいたわらんかい。Creepy looking ass. Freaking old man, like what the hell? なぜ私の推薦にこだわるのですか君の術式なら順位級くらいすぐなれますやっぱ数字って大事だと思うんですよ特に術師みたいに血生臭い職業にはでも俺は頭悪いから数字の通し方がわからなくなることがあるだから迷った時こう考えるんですナナミさんならどうするかそれでナナミさんに認められずに一級ってのは嘘でしょう。飲み物をすいて。マッコリオ。Really、内包水準一番。カイチ。ナミさんに任された以上2人を放ってはおけねえがかといってこいつら引き連れていくのもちげえよなベストは瞬殺して後輩チャンスと合流だせえ<笑> These two are gonna be powerful Yeah, but oh, wait, no, poison isn't affecting. I was about to say. It's his haircut. <laughs> yeah, she's doing something crazy, for sure. That's his grandma, man. Oh, shit. She's ulting. GG's. Ah, he had like two faces. Oh, look at him! It's little Gojo. プレゼントは私の制服姿です。可愛いでしょ。やっぱ森の国してよかった。別にいいけどさ、そんなに自信満々だと、いつかママみたいになっちゃうぞ。へえ。ママ嫌い。嫌いじゃないけど、浮気した
Jesus meu. Corosta, oroste va que no ni va está el aire cara no. Ima wa no kiwa ni sake no ta no wa. Aha oya no namae jatta ze. Savage. Come na se. ここが出してください。うるさい。へえ、へえ、へえ。人を殺す仕事なんだ。人体の仕組みはよく知っておかないとね。だ、ですね。俺たち受詐師は生きていた。五条悟。ええ。五条家に生まれた陸岸の子供です。ガキ。すでに当たるの賞金が億を超えています。ああ、これは依頼ではありません。早い者勝ちですよ。So who was protecting him when he was a baby? Oh, is a kid. Interesting. Nenen chikara o basu chibe. Ishun de likai shita. Sono gain o. Koitsu da. Gojo satori da. Rikujou kyogi no fudou no sekai kiroku ga kyu ni koushin sare dasu yo ni. Figure skater ga aru senshi o sakai ni tsugi tsugi to jump no kaiten. They all needed to adapt. Gojo satori ga umarete. Yeah. That's so cool. He super sounded like uh, Kill you with her. <laughs> Maybe he just regenerates really quickly. Sorosoro. Cool. Rabbit. Hair. That's Fingy's dad, yeah, I was gonna say. I was gonna say when I saw the half of his face. I was gonna say it, but I wasn't sure. No way. Chungus! That's a big boy. Yeah, it's Fingy's role. <laughs> hey, hey.
So what happens if you just poke him and do nothing? あ、ベコペだ。いたとりより。タイミングを外された俺の打撃が効いていた。上、デコピンで Classic anime. Classic. <laughs> One inch punch. way to end it with those two it really is <laughs> so good man so good um i love it when fights in show it's one of the reasons i absolutely loved hunter x hunter is when you have a fight between two characters or more than two whatever and there's there's much more to it than meets the eye so uh like exactly what happened there we did the fight they realized something went through with the plan, but we didn't know the plan. Then you go back and see the plan, and then you see the execution. It's, it's, it's not easy to do right, and sometimes it can be confusing or overwhelming, but that was done perfectly. God, MVP's a tough one, because the three bros were really good. You know what? I think he's probably dead, so I'm going to give him MVP. He also was really good this episode. It's uh, Bandana Bro. I don't know his name. Um, the one who really like uh, looks up to Nanami. I hope he isn't dead. And I wonder what's going to happen when uh, Kugisaki goes to see his dad up top. Really, really looking forward to that. What, what an what a interesting layer to add to the show that wasn't there at all. And, and the viewer didn't think of it at all. And then bang. Yeah, let's put a cursed person who can, like, summon um, past defeated foes or something like that. And it's going to be Kugisaki's dad, and he's probably going to fight him. That is going to be really cool. Yeah, those the, the, the cursed spirit's powers in this show are really, really interesting and really, really well done. And it's so fun finding out about them. And yeah, man. The music this episode might have been the best music in the whole show so far. Really, really solid OST. And yeah, can't wait to get to the next uh, episode. So be sure to like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Um, check out the Patreon, patreon.com forward slash Amario RPG. And I'll see you guys next time for more Jujutsu Kaisen.